Hello, my lovely lovelies, and welcome to Alive with Aaliyah. Today, it's time for more beneficial insects. And then, of course, I sprayed down where I'm going to put them the light mist. And it's 7 o'clock, so getting towards evening time. Sunset is at 8, but it's like I can't even believe how bright this is right now. So of course, you gotta have your ladybugs. And then also, this is green lace wing eggs. And there are actually plenty of them that have hatched in here. I can see a lot of them crawling around. And they're on cards. So, I don't know. Mostly I have aphids right now, but I heard that the lace wings can also help uh, with stink bugs and have a lot of those eating my leaves. That I, I heard that the green lace wings can uh, eat the stink bugs in their larval form. So here's to hoping that we these two beneficial insects that we can have some luck. So let's get a closer look there. Mm -hmm. So I've already done a release of adults before. It says, method for release. For optimal results, release eggs onto plants that have been lightly misted with water or apply after a rain. We recommend applying the eggs at sundown to allow for protection and to create sufficient time for hatching larvae to settle into their new environment. If the eggs are received during the day, hold the violet room temperature until the evening. Use within 24 hours of receipt. So I've done ladybugs before, and this is a larger amount. And I love having ladybugs around. And again, this is from, um, these are both from Arbico um, Organics. And it has a handy little booklet with release instructions. When you see, receive your ladybugs, allow them to adjust to their environment by allowing them to cool down or warm up to room temperature. If you're not going to apply them the day you receive them, sprinkle the outside of the sack with water to give them a drink and allow it to dry. Oh, I should have given them some water while I was waiting. Um, but I got them today, so it shouldn't be so bad. It's a hot day though. And some other directions. Um, release ladybugs in the evening when it's cool and not in the heat of day. Lightly water the area where you, you will, where you will be releasing the ladybugs. They will be thirsty from their long journey. Uh, make sure that there are some pest insects present. Do not release too many ladybugs at a time. Uh oh. Sounds like something that I might do. Release ladybugs by a tablespoon by tablespoon amounts, small handfuls at a time onto plant foliage. It is not necessary to use the entire sack all at once. Put a few ladybugs out every day, every other day, for two to four applications for best results. Do not freeze. For heavy infestations, release all the ladybugs at once throughout the garden. I don't have a heavy infestation. Uh, generally, one to three releases are necessary for control. So I'll try to save some because we bought a large amount. I'm still worried it might be a little too warm. The sun is just so intense. And we're still a ways, less than an hour from sunset, but I don't like working around in the dark. Whoa! Alright, so let's try to see if we can put the cork back on that. Whoops. Okay, we're going to start off in a cooler part of the yard, but I found a little direct sun here to, of course, melt myself for the camera. So I'm very confused by these green lace wing cards. I'm just going to kind of open up the bag and see. There's like a row of eggs. Let me try to show you. For now, I think I'm just gonna shake them onto some plants. Okay, so I 
I clearly do not understand how this works. I believe I'm going to take these little sections. separate them out. And then you have these individual tags after you tear them at the preparations to set them out in various locations. So that's how you do it. So here some of my pent stem ends that have some sort of critters on it. So hopefully my big tub lace wing can help me out. So I'm gonna grab one of my little egg tags and it's got, it's already got a little tear there. And I'm just gonna stick it somewhere somewhat discreet. Where am I? There we are. I'm just going to keep on going with these. So this is happening. So I finally got the tie on the top. It was really hard to clear the ladybugs out of that front area and I still have them down here so I'll find a cool place to put them and give them a little splash of water so that I can um, do a few more applications over time. Like they said, one or three, um, one to three releases are necessary. Thank you so much for joining me today as we released some ladybugs, live ladybugs, and we also put out some eggs for the green lace wings, and hopefully using beneficial insects for pest control for aphids and the like will help us to have healthy plants and a wildlife friendly garden. This has been Alive with Aaliyah. Click like, subscribe, live in love with life.